what a day it's been. What a day and it's not even four o'clock. Okay, I have 15 minutes to record today. <laughs> Man, I really pushed that one. Don't worry, there'll be a part two on this video of me also playing the same episode, but you don't have to worry about that. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I am the one, the only, Sammy B in the house. I'm sorry, my beating was too loud for my cat. I'm sorry. Hi, welcome. If you're new here, this is awesome. Thank you for being a part of my Sammy B family. Man, that rhymes. Sammy B family. Did you guys know that already? I don't know. <laughs> I am seeing so many new subscribers. You guys have no idea what it means to me when I wake up and I look and I've gained not one, not two, but like three subscribers? Are you, are you kidding me? This is a dream come true. And you guys are making my dreams come true. And I hope that you can feel and have that energy reflected back to you because I am all about positive energy. So if you aren't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button so I can share my love and my good vibes with you as well. And it would mean so much to me as it is my dream, as you all know, to reach 1,000 subscribers. I'm just watching my cat go upstairs. <laughs> He's so cute. So yeah, uh, we're so close, you guys. We're <laughs> getting so close. And each and every one of you mean everything to me. So thank you for being here and supporting me and this channel. Um, so let's get started because I obviously have not much time today because I, I don't know. Also it's snowing and it's the 5th of October. So that's different. Okay, I have 13 minutes. So let's begin the, oh yeah, not so berry challenge episode 12. Look, it's snowing just like it is here. Also, I forgot to turn on my lights. I literally charged them just for this episode. There. You see them? You're welcome. All right. She, see, I literally look like her today. I'm like so cool. Oh, Ayla. Hey, man. I think Dustin Brooke is pretty cute. Should I ask him out? Yes, girl. Sorry. I really don't know what's up with this energy. Oh, sis. What are you doing? Okay, what are we even doing? <laughs> she is stanky. Oh, and it's night. So we just obviously got home from work. So let's hit the shower. Oh, she was already doing that. And she wants to cloud gaze. That is so sweet. Ernesto, let's get you going on your job. You need some breakthroughs. So have some water while you read Orbital Pudding. This doesn't sound like a very interesting book. It's nonfiction. I never remember if that's real or not real. Probably not real, right? Zachary Quinn. A mountain size. Okay, so it's not. Glo uh, <laughs> a mountain size glob of coconut pudding is lobbed into orbit to study its potential for sustainability. Sustaining life on other planets. Best Sterling. Ah, what's wrong with my mouse? Do you know? This girl calls me in my pack legacy challenge all the time. Link up here if you haven't got on the little pack legacy challenge train yet. Best challenge I've ever seen so far. And I've written my own, which is even better than any others that you've seen. If you've seen any. Not to, you know, talk so highly of myself, but I think confidence is important. Anyways, whoa, I thought she was pregnant for a sec. I'm like, what did we miss? What have we missed? We work tomorrow. And remember, we don't like cooking. So let's uh, order some food. Oops, that's not the phone. Let's order some food for dinner. Zoomers. Okay, I'm gonna get mint e capri salad and a spaghetti for Ernesto. Sounds so good. And while she's on the computer, work on our mischief skill. And it looks like Ernesto has to clean the litter box because he's a good man. Yeah. Hi, sweetie! Oh, it's so funny, as I said that, the cat started meowing in my headphones. He's putting himself to sleep at nine. <laughs> this sounds like me. Uh, that's funny. Did she just break the computer? Oh, no, she didn't. Is it? Is it here yet? Oh, it's here! Oh, but... Ernesto went to bed, so we gotta wake him up and be like, babe, dinner's ready, honey. Oh my god, I'm not, I am wearing mint. I'm so sorry. Here's my mint for today, okay? These little earrings, I'm sure you've seen them before. And then I have this necklace on. It's really long, but I'll show you. It's Labradorite. It's a beautiful stone. You can kind of see there's like mint color in there. It's really pretty, so 
That's all the mint I have on for you today. Little is better than nothing. Okay, mint, where did you put the food, sweetheart? You didn't even grab- Oh, because she's- My bad. Oh. My bad. I forgot that she was busy on the computer. He's cold! Oh, I feel so bad because we should have tipped him. Oh, the poor guy. And Ernesto's going to bed. This is- I'm too distracted. Oh, I'm so sorry, everybody. Okay, Ernesto, you go here. Mint, you go here. Let's uh, unload the delivery bag. Oh god, it's so cold in here. I have no power, no heat. <laughs> How are you running your computer? Magic. Magic. Hopes and dreams. Oh, I know! You guys need to clean up. Oh my god, why do I have to clean up for you? Is this like totally in the way? Mint. Whoa, that snowman is actually really pretty. Oh my gosh, it's like I forget how to play the game. You can start eating. Wakey shaky, everyone. And you can start eating. You could just sit at the table with your plate. That's totally fine. Oh, I have, ooh la la. Sexy, sex. Sorry, I don't know. <laughs> I thought that was really pretty lingerie, but. And he's just gonna eat in here. That's all right. I, he likes sports, right? So. Um, <laughs> let's just get him to watch some sports. Oh, look at him! Aww, that's cute. And then she's like, she's over here. Are you like, can you like, become companions? Why are we not companions yet? Somebody explain this to me. I love this. This outfit on her looks so fine. <laughs> she's so happy. I feel like Mint should have glasses eventually. That she looks so good with glasses. Mochi Pichi! Machu Picchu! Feel the love! I love that they're the same color! That is so cute! Okay, we kissed him goodnight, so let's head to bed. Oh, Ernest was already in bed. Oh my gosh. Did my timer go off yet, or do we still have a little bit of time together? Five minutes! I don't wanna- I don't wanna say goodbye. Even though, like I said, I'm just gonna transition the new future me into this video, so you won't say goodbye, but you'll say goodbye to this high energy me because I just, this is rare, <laughs> especially lately. Rebate day was awful. I don't care about rebate day. Okay, wait, isn't all the lights supposed to be on um, auto? All lights? Yeah, except for those. Okay. Ernesto is stinky. Okay. Oh, but she's flirty. Oh, she wants to kiss her. You know what I'm thinking? You know what I'm thinking? No, not trough for baby. <laughs> Hello. I'm freezing. Honestly, I am freezing. She's <laughs> oh. so like, before you hop in the shower, um, what, you can't do it? Why? Weird. Well, I'm gonna get Ernesto to take a thoughtful shower, and I'm gonna get mint to fill Meliku's bowl. And I'm also gonna get her to take out the trash. And also, we need to find more elements. So remember we have some, I feel like we should maybe do that at work today. It's like, wow, we can actually look for quite a few things. I thought this was a dicky thing behind our house. Does it? Oh, there's one. There. Got three things going on right now before work. Although we should probably eat, but I don't think we're gonna have enough time. Yeah, we're definitely not gonna have enough time. We dug up a capsule. It's probably one of those like collectible things, hey? Most likely. We found a striped leaf frog. What? Do you think frogs are gross? Wait, stop! Let's set off a firework. Because we're mischievous. Let's scare people. Okay, let's join her. Oh, darn it. We're gonna have to like stop in the middle of a work day. Does that even work? Can you just... Guess we're gonna find out. Okay, this time we are not, I repeat, not going to light off a firework inside of the building. Why are you so uncomfortable, Mint? Mint! Can we give... Ooh, let's do a funny introduction. We have someone new working at the desk. Who are you? Mel Prescott. Okay. I was just thinking we could give her like an untested thing. Goth boy. <laughs> that's weird. And since Mint doesn't like frogs. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> I just leave it here. You guys go. That's so freaking cute. Mint, don't be mean. Mint. Mint. 
take deep breaths. I need you to go work on the rocket. You're too uncomfortable to do anything. There we go. There we go. Also, we need to dig. Dig, dig, dig. Uh, just wondering like where we should dig. Like, look at the size of this lot. This is massive. Well, let's go over here and dig these because like, okay, I'm just gonna quickly dig these and then I'm gonna end the episode here. I don't know if it'll like pop us back at her work when I pick this off, but we're gonna find out, okay? We're gonna find out. But right now we need to finish that element collection and we're gonna just dig for some more crystals. Capsule, Furium, Emerald. Keep digging. Another capsule. Okay, I know I have to go, but like just one more. I know, I know, I know, I know. I gotta go like right now. <laughs> it's gonna be late. <laughs> Called it. But I'm doing this for you guys, for us. What do we get? We found a rose crystal? Alcron we've had. We got some salvage parts that we can sell. So I think we got some new parts here. Or sorry, new crystals. Do you feel like we need to keep that potato? I'm just saying, like, probably not. Wow, these are pretty. Another capsule. Another capsule. Another capsule. <laughs> Please no. Hello, crystals. What's in this one? Oh, so, okay, I bet this one's a capsule. I bet this one's a crystal because look at the mounds. They are different, cut like, this one's got crystals, and this one's got, like, crystals and rocks in it. So, Daryl! Yeah, okay. Our old crush. This one's gonna be a crystal. I figured it out! I figured the system out. Bet it's a crystal. Yep, see? Figured it out. Shinolite. So, she's, like, brought together by friends. Oh, she's happy that she... Ernesto, can you work hard, please? And... Mint, I'm gonna have to say goodbye to you right now, but I will be back. Hopefully you will be still here in the desert standing right here. <laughs> I am gonna let you guys go. I will be right back and look totally different. Okay guys, I am back. I know I look a little different because it is a new day, but it is not a new day in The Sims. We are exactly where we left off three seconds ago. So let's see what we have to do do we did find some crystals so i don't know like should we just focus on getting crystals today it might not be a bad idea um we could go check out these ones over here remember we're only gonna dig the ones with crystals because the other one's like collectible stuff and we don't we don't need that i just really think we should work on that element collection it just seems like you know we're missing i think three which isn't that bad but <laughs> It would be nice to finish something off of our list. We found plumbite! And a diamond. And a rose. She's probably gonna pee herself. And a ruby. And a capsule. And amethyst. And simonite. Are any of these new? Who's this? Why do you wanna- No, we don't have time. We have to pee. After she's done that, I'm gonna send her inside to go pee. And we got a treasure map. Okay, not really what I wanted. Oh, our, our mess from last time. <laughs> I feel like we should just get the runs to clean that up. Now we're just digging up capsules. Ooh, she gave up on these two. Well, that's okay. I think we were just getting capsules at, cap, yeah, capsules at this point. Uh, order coworker to analyze metals. Let's order Paka to analyze metals. She really has to pee though, like really bad. She barely made it, but we made it. Are we getting that promotion today? Uh, yes. Let's get uh, this guy to do it then. Analyze metals for me, Hector. Okay, I think we should stay late. What? Why are you ignoring me, Missy? I'm telling you to talk to Hector. Come on! Why can't you do it? And let's say hi to Ayla real quick. Ooh, we can mind control her to clean. Discuss work for a little bit and then mind control her to clean. I, I don't think she'd mind. She knows that we gotta do what we gotta do. Oh, we're, are we done? Oh, wait, what is this? They know their worth. Looks like Mint just be befriended an egotistical sim. 
egotistical sims have high standards and even higher opinions of themselves, they often seek to flaunt their wealth and possessions and demand the best out of every experience. In terms of sip preferences, would you say that Mint likes egotistic sims? I think she would because remember, I think the first trait that we picked for her was like she was a snob or something. I think we ended up changing it because it wasn't a mint color and it just made no sense to me since this is like a color challenge. Um, but we're gonna say yeah, that she likes egotistic sims. I didn't really expect Ayla to be egotistic, but um, Hector is reporting that he analyzed some yatranium. So I wonder if we can analyze an element. Meliku! <laughs> let's, let's um, analyze some Meliku. We may or may not get that promotion, which I'm a little bit disappointed if we don't, because we didn't last workday either, but that was because this happened. <laughs> and you all remember what happened there. Oh well, what can you do? But her logic skill is nicely going up. Oh, she wants to be mischievous. Ooh, I wonder what we can do. Is anyone here? I wonder if we could just pop on the computer really quickly to do that. I know it's not gonna help get a promotion, but I just feel like it really fits with the story, okay? It's not all about goals, it's about writing a story. That's why Sims is so beautiful. There, she is done. She found a new element. Wait, wait, wait. Does that mean we can like add that to our um thing, our, our collection? Voltenon? Volenton. I feel like we have that one already. I don't know, but I guess we'll find out. What is this? What do we do with it? Nothing. Tell story to self. Talk to self. Oh, I just don't... I don't know if we're gonna... We're so close. Mint, I don't think you have enough time to analyze a metal. Let's do Furium. But for some reason that didn't work. That kind of was a waste of time. But let's see if we have enough time to analyze this metal. We have like eight seconds. Ooh, yeah, we're not gonna finish. Shoot. Shoot! We didn't get the promotion. That's okay. She did her best. But she did an adequate job. Yeah, we didn't we didn't really get that much done, but we did get a vacation day, which is nice. Welcome back to Brooks Bridge Borrow. Snowy day. Snowy day. Oh, she is so hungry. So let's have Ernesto order us some food because neither of them enjoy cooking, which is totally fine. So let's see. We're going to get another Capri salad for Mint and a chicken stir fry for Ernesto. And Mint, you're going to go take a bath. I think that sounds really nice. I think that's super cute. Wait, wait, wait. Let's see if one of our new elements fits. Are you guys ready? While she goes and does that. What's this? Ozonite? Sometimes, so as I edit these videos, sometimes I notice that like, it takes like three tries to get it in. That's what she said. But actually for real though, I'll like put it in, it'll be highlighted. It won't go in and then like I'll try again and then it goes in. So I'm just gonna like really make sure. But it looks like we have those ones, and I believe we have Meliku already. Not just our kitty. And let's see, do we have any more? Oof, we have lots of those cases to open up. We have so many things in our inventory. Okay, well, I don't know if we should keep these uh, extra. I mean, I guess they're good for work. I wonder which ones we're missing. I wish there was like a little chart that told us. Ooh, someone's flirty. Oh, here we are. Let's not leave this guy out in the cold again. We should even probably tip him. And uh, while she's waiting, let's get her to do some mischievous things on the computer. Delivery man, uh, I just don't believe we're going to be eating this outside. But you know what? I will uh, give you a $10 tip for your kindness. Yes. And then let's unload. What a sweetheart. Buying us dinner. Okay, Mint, how is your, uh... So maybe this computer thing isn't counting as being mischievous for some reason. Which it should, because it's a mischievous accent. Accent. Ac interaction. I'm so sorry. Don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> All right, it's dinner time. Ooh, it's pretty late, actually. <laughs> That's okay. He wants to order pizza. I should have ordered pizza. Darn it. I didn't see that till now. And he wants to stay on lot for eight hours. Well, he probably will since he'll be sleeping. Okay, so 
Uh, we still cannot... Let's, like, maybe we'll eat, uh... Ernest, awake. Ernest, awake! Let's eat and watch TV at, this, at the uh, same time together. I think that would be really cute. So, no, 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 wait. Eat over here. Ew, Vlad, please stop. Stop it, Vlad. Stop it, Vlad. And then let's, uh, what do you think they would watch together? Comedy? I think, oh, what? Maybe they'd ro watch romance because they're both in a romantic mood. I don't know. It's kind of weird that they're all uh, getting you know, flirty together. A special connection. Oh, that is so cute. Plan to wrap it bacon around everything. Because <laughs> they're partners in crime. Oh, I love that. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, now they're not watching TV at all. She's like, what do you think? He's like, yeah. Actually, that's a really good idea. There. Hey, that counted as a mischievous interaction. So that kind of worked out. And she also wants to prank someone. Do you think she would prank her boyfriend? I do, but Ernesto, wait! Ernesto, wait! Before you go to bed, I know you uh, love to go to bed early, but I want to get men to prank you. And then I also, uh, I think you guys should have a little woohoo before bed. Uh, mischievous, prank, uh, what's that spot? Mint! Wait! Ernesto, wait! Here we go. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh, he did that on his own! Well, guys, do you think that they would... Oh, no! I didn't mean to do that! Don't do it! guys i can't believe they just got engaged i did not mean to do that i swear i did not mean to click it i thought that was the spot for the intimate because that's usually where it is on the wheel it's the third one. Oh, i can't believe they just got engaged i guess um it was just the heat of the moment maybe she's been carrying that ring around for a while and she wanted to just do it in the comfort of their own home with Neliku there oh my god they just got engaged <laughs> I guess he might be the one. <laughs> New personality trait. Mint is feeling particularly loyal and committed to her relationship these days. Trust is important to her. Embrace the change that she's loyal. So I was going to say that, she, you know, because she's mischievous and evil or mean or something, I, I didn't know if he was going to be the one or if she would end up leaving him for someone else. And I don't normally do that in my playthroughs. But because this is supposed to challenge you to do different things, I figured it might be something fun to try. But it looks like she has officially gotten over her crushes and, you know, wanting to date other people. She feels very committed and loyal. She pretty much just officially said that Ernesto's the one and she feels very loyal to him. <laughs> Reached the max number of times she can embrace a self-discovery trait. That's kind of cool. Wow, I cannot believe they just got engaged. I did not plan that. <laughs> so what does that mean exactly? Loyal Sims value their relationships and fully commit to them, whether they are friendship, romance, or even work. That's actually perfect for her. They avoid lying and cheating because their loved ones trust is very important to them. Oh, I love that. Well, you guys, um, <laughs> I think it is time to take this to the next level and maybe, you know, you know exactly where I'm going with this. We are going to try for a baby. Baby! I mean, they don't... Do they know they're doing it or are they just not using protection? You know? I think they... <laughs> I mean, we don't have to get into details, but I think they're going to have a little bit of fun and excitement tonight and celebrate their new engagement to each other. Oh, look, she even chose her sexy lingerie. Ooh, okay. I'm going to give them a little privacy, but... Uh, they are officially engaged, which I <laughs> didn't see coming in this episode, but I think that is so sweet. I'm going to check and see how... What's that sound? 
you guys hear that? It's like, holy, they are knocking that bed frame against the wall. <laughs> wow. Okay, guys. Oh, I was actually just gonna say, when does she become an adult? Because we do have to start thinking about the next generation. As <laughs> what is that? She's thinking about being. No, she's thinking about pranking. Shives. Oh wow. He's like. Why would you nap on the couch? Maybe they got a little messy in the bed. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you know this is so dirty and so weird. Ooh, he is so much younger than her. Wow. Okay. Well, I was actually very curious to see how old she is, but her birthday is tomorrow. So that'll be next episode. So I was kind of saying that I do believe that we are going to have to start really focusing on getting these challenges done. Oh, it's Christmas too! Oh, that is so exciting! Well, oh, are you pregnant? Can you just sleep a little bit longer? Do you guys want to find out the pregnancy in this episode or next episode? I actually won't get the answer, so I'm just going to have to try to mind read what the future of you guys would say. Wait, go back to sleep! I know you're excited, but like... Just get a full night's sleep, please, both of you. Aww, Reese is so happy. We should invite him over for Christmas today. I know that I just want them to sleep in a little. Oh, I bet someone's telling her congrats too. Oh, we just became friends with Ayla. I thought we were always friends with Ayla. Anyways, what I'm trying to say is I am just a little bit thinking about the next generation, which is red generation. Uh, of course, we already have the nursery. Oh, channeling the... Uh, Lullaby music. It's, that's just a non-stop record. I, I feel like I'm channeling a boy here, but it doesn't necessarily mean we have to have a boy. Ooh, it's pretty dusty in there. See, it's time to start using the room. See, I even have this little thing over where the crib's gonna go, which I think is so cute. But, well, I think we should take a pregnancy test. She really has to use the bathroom, and I, I don't see why not. But I've been thinking about maybe starting the next gen because, I mean, we're not really quite there yet with all of our skills, but it doesn't mean that we don't, can't start the next gen. And I mean, she's only just becoming an adult, so we still have quite a bit of time to work on our goals and things, but I just thought it might be time. Let's find out. She's telling him how that is the best Christmas gift I think anyone could ever get. Wait, if you're obviously you? trying for me. <laughs> we're having a baby! And then what is he doing? What is he doing? Where is he going? I thought he was gonna go. He's gonna go clean! Oh, babe, I'm gonna go clean the house and start buying things for the baby room. I might uh, just quickly put the nursery together in this episode and see what that looks like. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. Here is the nursery. I just, I mean, we can still kind of work on it. Obviously, it, it can change, but I have uh, this little bassinet underneath these light curtains. I should leave these on, actually, uh, at all times. I think that's very beautiful. Uh, you don't see it when you zoom in, but I think that that's such a cozy look. And then I got a changing station, a nice cozy red rug, little ladybug, and then I added a little chair for like reading. And since our little nugget is going to be born in the season of winter, I added this little cute rug in his, um, his? <gasps> Are we manifesting the gender right now? in his or her future bedroom. Uh, we got like the future potty. Again, like we're, we're gonna add to it, but I just thought I'd get something started. Um, Ernesto pretty much just ran out the door and grabbed some things for the nursery because he loves taking care of this family. And we have a little bookshelf here because we might have a little nugget who loves to read. And then I thought this little, I don't know if it's a night light. It definitely looks like one, but it's got this little leaf on it which I think is so adorable and of course we're gonna leave this record player in here as it channeled the whole nursery anyways so here is our beautiful happy family it is winter fest and that is what we'll be celebrating in the next episode I hope you guys enjoyed this episode 
I am just as excited and surprised as you guys are. Ernesto is so excited that he heard that they're having a baby as well as he's <laughs> he's excited to be engaged. So he is on cloud nine. She's also excited to be engaged and she's excited and ecstatic that she's okay. I thought she was in second trimester already. I'm like, well, I don't think so. <laughs> but that is a little bit insane. So I'm hoping that she gets her promotion before she goes on maternity leave. We're already halfway through. We're on level five. So as a research and development lead, it is up to you to make sure future sim lab stays at the forefront of scientific innovation. So we still got quite a ways to go, but the new gen is on the way and it's time guys. It is time to begin red gen, but we're still focusing on, on, on mints needs. And next episode we will have Winterfest together and it's gonna be a lot of fun so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss a single episode and help me reach my dream of reaching a thousand subscribers and I'll see you on the next one bye guys see you there